Hey folks, in today's video, we are diving into the steps to set up a SAML connection between Okta, acting as the identity provider, and Auth0, acting as the service provider. We will first set up the Okta side in our Okta developer console. On the left, we click on Application and then Application. Once on the Applications window, select Create App Integration. Choose SAML 2.0 from the options and click Next. On the Create SAML Integration window under General Settings, enter a name in the App Name field and click Next. Under the Configure SAML tab, enter the Auth0 Tenant Login Callback URL in the Single Sign-On URL field. The highlighted portion is your domain, and the connection name will be the same name that will be assigned by setting up the SAML Enterprise connection on the Auth0 side. If the custom domain has been configured within the tenant, it should be the custom domain that is used in place of your domain, and not the Auth0 default domain. In the Audience URI SP Entity ID field, enter URN Auth0, your tenant, and the connection name. The highlighted portion should be your tenant name. Scroll down and click on Next. Under the Feedback tab, leave everything to the default settings and click Finish at the bottom of the page. Now that these steps have been completed, the login flow will be redirected to the sign-on page for the newly created app. On the right, you can click on View SAML Setup Instructions that will take you to the How to Configure SAML 2.0 for Application window. This is where you'll find the Identity Provider Single Sign-On URL and the X509 certificate, which needs to be downloaded for later use when it needs to be uploaded into the Auth0 SAML connection setup. Now, to assign a user to this Okta application, back on the Okta console, go to the Assignments tab at the top, click on Assign, and select Assign to People. In the Assign App to People pop-up window, click Assign to the corresponding user, Click Save and Go Back, then click Done. Now that we have set up the Okta application, let's move on to the setup on the Auth0 side. Log in to the Auth0 dashboard. On the left, click Authentication, then click Enterprise. On the Enterprise Connections window next to the SAML tab, click on the plus to the right to create a new connection. On the new SAML connection window, enter a name in the connection name field at the top. This should be the same name used previously to set up the Okta application. Under the sign in URL field, enter the URL that can be found in the OctaView SAML setup instructions. From the How to Configure SAML 2.0 application window, copy and paste the URL under the Identity Provider single sign on URL. Under X509 signing certificate, you can upload the X509 certificate, which was downloaded from the Okta configuration. Scroll down to X509 certificate and click on Choose File on the new SAML connection window and upload the certificate. After uploading, click on Create at the bottom of the screen. Navigate to the Applications tab at the top and toggle on the application to create an association between the application and the desired connection. Now that the setup is complete, we can navigate to the dashboard and click on Enterprise under Authentication. Once on the Enterprise Connections window, click on SAML to the right of your connection, click on the three dots, then click on Try from the options to check the connection. A message will display indicating that your connection is successful. Today we learned how to set up a SAML connection between Okta acting as the identity provider and Auth0 acting as the service provider. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to us on YouTube.